All right, so my name is uh, Ivo Stuyfstand, and I'm a senior use experience lead for IMS Guided Therapy. And in that role, I'm responsible for orchestrating the uh, strong and consistent use experience across the portfolio. To be an experience lead at Philips means... Pain in the ass. Yeah, eh? that's true. Eric van Androoy. I'm product designer for 32 years in Philips. And the last 22 years, I think it was uh, uh, IGT. So uh, I've been uh, working for this team quite a long time already. I always like to be creative. Now, for example, when I played uh, video games, I always liked the building of your house, like in The Sims, and then not play with the characters, but build the next house, right? So it's really about creating. Every form, every object that we make is communicating with people. So it's about communication. And it starts with the basic element. Sketching is communication. And so how do I communicate from words to a sketch to a product? And because you have people, you have an object, and you have the space. And the main aim is to get that patient that is in a stress situation, um, about his health, supporting that patient throughout the journey. So uh, Azurian was born out of the uh, trend that we see that there are more and more complex procedures that involve uh, multiple clinical disciplines next to uh, the more uh, uh, traditional interventional cardiology uh, that we uh, started with. And these disciplines also bring their own equipment, uh, their own tools, their applications, and it all comes together in this single treatment space. So most projects always start with um, doing an inventory of what's already known in, um, in our organization and to apply that knowledge uh, to give the project's direction. But we never forget that the world around us is changing, so we also go out and we, uh, we identify customers and uh, validate that uh, what we cooked up is actually um, effective and safe to use as well. I think the most important is seeing people using the equipment and being able to perform better. The, the other part, of course, is yeah, the fun with the team yeah, because you, as a, you don't do it alone. You, we worked on this system for 10 years in total, so it's like a team, like a family. It takes 10 years not because the, the technology is complicated or not uh, available to achieve what we want to achieve. It takes 10 years to make a safe and validated medical product. So we set ourselves a challenge to come up with an image-guided therapy solution that uh, allows these uh, interventional teams to perform these procedures with all these different equipment, tools and devices while preserving the ease of use and the flexibility to perform a variety of procedures. Yeah, it took us, I think, almost six months to design the main control button where you intuitive are able to manipulate the 900 kilos of steel. And that process is, is, is lengthy, costly, but very important to make sure that we do not do any harm to patients or staff and that the clinical outcome is actually uh, improved. The basic thing of product design is observing and then create concepts, review them with them, and that's the way you, you act in the process. Yeah? To be um, successful as a designer, I think it's all about uh, staying uh, curious and, and also uh, do not give up on your vision too soon. If you really want to achieve something, hold on, go through a curve of disappointment and then get your success. It was really this kind of an attitude is Philips Design. It's they give you opportunities and you as a person define what you're going to do with it and where you can make the difference. And I think that is definitely the reason I still stay at Philips Design.